to create semi-round window, we will use subdivided plane, 2 by 1. Place plane over your reference and center it. Move plane to the bottom and scale it to match one of the frame's heights. Turn symmetry on, switch to edge and start excluding window frame. Horizontally and then vertically. Exclude frame and ignore glass panels and spaces between panels for now. Use Move and Rotate tool to get proper curvature of the window top. Please take your time and remember to save your file from time to time. After you finish working on the window frame, turn off symmetry and bridge all the gaps and spaces between glass panels. Turn symmetry on and remove extra edges. Reduce edges around bottom corners by target welding them to the center of each corner. Turn off symmetry. Duplicate window frame twice so you can use copies to create window glass panels and mesh to boolean window openings later. You can create window glass from single piece or use several pieces. I'm choosing second option because it will give me great flexibility to apply separate textures for each panel. To create glass panels use the bridge tool and close openings in one of the copies that you made. Delete Frame Mesh. Select Polygons, excluding Tint Strip and exclude to add thickness to your window. Next, select Polygonal Faces, that belongs to the window outer frame and exclude again. Select unnecessary edges and delete them. Move glass and fit it in the window frame. 
Make extra copy of the window template and extrude outer edge. Go to the top view, drag select all polygons and next hold down control button and unselect newly created mesh. Delete front part. Please remember to create new layer for your window before you start modeling next object. In next video we will model door. Thank you.